Okay, it is April 19th, 2016, and I am on my way to Coaldale, an adjacent city, because I received a phone call from Alberta Fish and Wildlife. They have a snake incident in progress out here, and they don't have an officer who can get to the scene. So they called me, they asked me if I could help, and <laughs> of course, I'm on the fucking spot. I'm gonna be there. So I'm on my way. Um, I'm probably five minutes away at this point. I'm gonna check out what's happening. Apparently, there's a snake in a bar. Um, I suspect it's a bull snake. That's what's going on these uh, couple of days here. Last or yesterday, I got my first call for a bull snake pickup. And typically the bull snakes and, uh, and garter snakes move out first. Rattlesnakes are to follow. But today's a little too soon for rattlesnakes, so we'll see. If it is a rattlesnake, I'll be surprised. If it's a bull snake, that's what I'm expecting. So we'll find out. Okay, I'm on the main drag in Coldale. And McClellan's is right across the street here. And we'll see what they've got going on some kind of snake <laughs> we'll see what kind hey <laughs> the managing officer over there him and I walk over here and we come around here there's a little piece of tape on the on the floor here and we right jump <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got him in a bucket. Yeah, I got him in a bucket. That's nice. Yeah. So, is it a bull snake or is it a rattle? Yeah, I think it's a bull snake. Or I thought it was maybe a corn snake. But... There's not a natural corn snake here. Yeah, it's just a bull snake. Oh, there's a hog nose snake, some garter snakes, and some rattlers. Well, his, his mat is pretty good. Um, yeah, it's a bull snake. Bull snake? Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty good. Hey, buddy. Look at you. That's a nice thing. Yeah. Look, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> he was hissing at us pretty good. Yeah, he, they they are really aggressive. They're more aggressive than the rattlesnakes, but if you know snakes, they're cool. Yeah. Yeah. Well, there you go. <laughs> well, we didn't want to cut him in half. Yeah. No, no. There's no reason to kill this guy. He's just getting rid of your mice. I'm sure he probably was. Yeah. But I, where where do you think he came from? Um, hard to say. I I picked up rattlesnakes here too in Coldale, so you got a snake population. And we got all the coolies and everything. This is all that's what it is, hey? We're in the coolies. And these guys are the first on the move, so the rattlesnakes aren't out. You know, I mean, they're out, but they're at, they're at their dens right now. These guys are, are the first to kind of like get on the move, go find their places for the summer. Well, he was moving in. He was moving in. <laughs> and I'll tell you, he walked, he walked by Doran's dog. Yeah. He got in here by Doran's dog. I, you know, unless he was kind of under Peter's thing. Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. He did. Where the mice are. Hey, hey, hey buddy. Yeah. Let you go where you can be uh, a hunter. <laughs> All right, so this is obviously a bull snake. Um, it's bull snake time here in southern Alberta. They're on the move. And this one is uh, is a very nice snake. I wish I knew where to relocate her here in Coldale, but I don't. I don't know like where where her territory is to take her back to. So I am going to um, displace her a little bit, bring her to Lethbridge, and um, release her at Shpopikami 
where there is an increasing number of bull snakes. It was funny watching the people at the bar <laughs> adjust to the, uh, the reality that this is not something to be feared. Um, if anything, if, if, if you look at any of the wild animals, these bull snakes and even rattlesnakes and definitely garter snakes are um, really among the most gentle creatures. So they got a bad rap, unfortunately, and I'm trying to defuse that by putting out these videos and I'm hoping that is making some kind of impact on the people in our area. These snakes are, are good animals. They're sweet, <laughs> to be honest. They don't mean anybody any harm. Um, and their only interest is in eating rodents. So, you have a, a bunch of mice at your place, you know, the snakes are coming for that, but they're not coming for you. That's what you got to keep in mind. Again, 